Let's do good stuff. Let's do the the Sean things. Yeah, and I'll do some fat watch and get out of here. Uh, this is more more confessions of Maddox. Yeah, uh, you ruined one of his writing sessions. Jeez. Apparently, I wonder he takes forever to put things out. Yeah, uh, I don't know if he. Do you think he's going to release something about the the takedown of his video? Well, he's going to make another video about it. Well, I mean, I think. I don't know. You kind of convinced me that he's probably not going he's not. to. Yeah, I kind of. I don't of know think if you still won't. feel that way, but I, I, I think you're right. Where it's like he won't draw attention to that because he there's no yeah there's no way he can argue his way out of it. Yeah, it's that's that would be like, really hard to do. A, that would take a really long video to explain oh, to lie about. No, yeah, how you're not a stalker. Even though YouTube says right. you're a stalker, I got done dirty. Yeah, yeah. And then once you put again, this on YouTube. no, I believe he could believe that. Yeah, but, but I don't think he could convince people. No, I don't. Think yeah, I don't so think either, he could yeah. think that he was thinking he was convincing people. Okay, which is which is, um, w- and that's going a fair distance because he, <laughs> I mean, he thinks that people are buying into all this other shit or will. And they or are, that, or that they kind of the, are. Who? What? What? They're buying into all his retarded shit. Hmm. Like he put so much out I mean, that like, there's something for everybody. No, I know, but like, I, you got to think most people are like these are the fucking ravings of a lunatic. Yes, but there's a lot of lunatics out there. There are. Uh, okay, this is how you ruined his writing session. Guess who's back? So uh, yeah, last time Sean ruined my love life. Honestly, it still hasn't recovered. Thanks a lot, Sean. However, yeah. he wasn't content with just being a nuisance in my personal life. He also messed with my professional life. Borderline tortuous interference, if you ask me. (laughs) Some of you may know that Fanboy and I were briefly writing partners. That was an ordeal in its own right, but Sean made it a nightmare. Mm. Let's see you weasel your way out of this one, Sean. You slippery snake. (laughs) (laughs) Sounds exactly like him. I mean... It's crazy. It's it's pretty good. Me and Fanboy would meet up and write stuff to pitch to studios, often unsuccessfully because of Fanboy because he can't write. Always uh. fumbling in the third period at the 18th hole. Also because he <laughs> shot down my best ideas, probably out of jealousy. It was like working with a drunk child, which is way harder than one would assume. I have no idea how Dan Schneider pulled it off. Anyway, one time Sean tagged along because he and Fanboy are married. Uh-oh. They were planning on doing something right after the writing session, something they didn't invite me to. Back then I thought it was a party. Knowing what I now know about them, I no longer assume it was a party. It was probably selling women or recruiting for the Proud Boys. <laughs> <laughs> selling women. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I wouldn't know how to price them. Uh, Sean promised to not disturb us while he browsed his phone. That would turn out to be a lie. Duh. At first, it was business as usual. Fanboy pitched stupid idea after stupid idea. Like, one right. of them was just Night Rider. You know, the supercar... And vigilante show. But the guy was drunk all the time. So the bad guys couldn't predict his advanced driving maneuvers. <laughs> That's a good I No shit. That's something you would pitch. Fanboy. Then Sean began fake coughing loudly. I sighed and asked for his input. Boy, do I regret it. I am too nice of a guy. It's my biggest flaw. Sean brought out a folder thick as a phone book of pitches. I could see fanboy cringe. Sean had obviously pitched these ideas to him before. And Fanboy didn't have the heart to tell them they were bad, so now it was my problem. Typical. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Sean's first pitch was literally a guy named Agent Seanson who plays guitar really well and robs <laughs> banks. To me, that seemed like a villain of the week, not a main character. Sean accused me of being part of, quote, uh, the shadowy banking cabal, end quote. Then Sean moved on to his next pitch. A black guy that goes to clubs acts a fool then kills everyone when he is asked to leave. Uh I said that's not even a plot and is kind of honestly really racist. Uh In the same vein, his next pitch was get out, but the white family was the good guys. Hard to blame him, though. This was before Black Lives Matter. We didn't know any better. God. Okay. What was it? Agent Seanson? (laughs) Yeah. He plays guitar really good? Yeah, and robs banks. (laughs) All right. Let's see here. Okay. Sean did have one pitch that was actually pretty promising. Never heard anything like it. It was a love story about a poor girl and a rich boy on a boat destined to sink. Also, there was zombies. I told Sean that it was more of a movie than a TV show. Sean claimed the bitches would love it and called dibs on inspecting the actress's feet. I humored the fools long (laughs) enough. It was time for my pitch. Basically full house, but based off my irresistibly quirky Utah family with the crazy neighbor character based off fanboy's enigma. 
This would have been our golden ticket. After a few meetings and phone calls, Fanboy and I were sitting at the studio big boy table, pen strokes away from making our show, Utah Dead Family, a reality. Utah Dead Family? Is that the name of his full house I, show? I guess. Okay. Mm, uh, Utah Dead Family show has got to be pretty sad these days. Yeah. Just an old lady, old gambling addict, and a brother who's... Now, I used to think he was more retarded than Maddox, but now I think maybe that's not Maddox possible. is the retarded one. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Well, because everything you know about them comes through him. Right? Yeah. And we have know that, like, he's, you know, when you you break this stuff down, you go, how is it possible that there's a more retarded Yeah, version Maddox? of you. I think this is just you huh. retardedly Explaining telling me everything. normal stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, one side of his family is totally normal, yeah. and all of his, like, half-brothers there are normal. But the other side, huh. the one that he was raised in, is fucked. Have you ever met any uh, uh, of siblings no. or anything like that? No, not that I'm aware. I of. take it from I mean, it's from the father, right? Like he's got half siblings. Yeah, from, yeah, yeah. Huh. Uh, okay, here's here's the conclusion, the okay. thrilling conclusion. I'm ready. I'm riveted. Oh, can you guess what happened next? Sean burst in, angry as hell. Fanboy had texted him about our opportunity because he was excited. Sean assumed we stole his ideas and were about to make it without him. He called me a thief and a pedophile. <laughs> the studio heads asked if this was true, and I denied both allegations. Wrong move. They were fine with stealing ideas, <laughs> but they only wanted to work with pedophiles. They assumed I was one. It was a different time in Hollywood. This was before me, too. The Hollywood still had a lot of growing up to do. Pretty standard for showbiz in those dark days to work with creeps. I have no idea why they thought I was one. The three of us got thrown out with no show to show for it. Nice one, Sean. You crushed my dreams. I am really confused as to how Sean is still allowed in polite society. Uh, Seriously, yeah. Sean, the day my lawyer gets sober, your days are numbered. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, very uh, good. Yeah. How could you do that? <laughs> I, I, you know, I just, uh, yeah. I just put the blinders on. I don't care who I run over, you know, yeah. it's. Uh, Autoids, uh, Antoid says, uh, I know the guy who made the Glenn Beck raped and killed a little girl in 1994 site. I didn't, I wasn't Wait, aware that, there was that Is that site. a real thing? What the fuck are you talking about? 